welcome back to my youtube channel hopefully you will see the demo video i think you enjoy it so if you wanted to make this one so please watch the video till the end so first what you need to do we need to install arduino id in our local machine okay so i already installed it but i wanted to show you how can you install it okay so first you have to go on your uh, browser and type arduino id download hit enter so it will open the arduino official website so from here arduino so uh, let's uh, go here and click to download so arduino id 1.8.13 so just you have to click here the windows file okay as a zip file so after downloading it okay you need to extract this one so if you, you, need, you need to click on here so it will uh, download it as zip file so after downloading the zip file uh, you have to extract this file so after extracting this file uh, you can find here like this okay so like this file so you need to click on here and just click on the Arduino. Okay. So click on here. So the Arduino. So the Arduino uh, software is opening in your screen. Okay. So it takes some time to uh, open this ID. Okay. So you can see here this is the verify and this is the upload. So using this upload button, you can upload the programs in your uh, Arduino ID not Arduino in your Arduino circuit okay and this one you can uh, generate some hex file and to you can also using some simulation to using this hex file okay so but uh, when you are trying to upload this code in your Arduino circuit or you can say Arduino ID in circuit so it will give you some error cause uh, if you are doing it in your first time doing it first time so you need to actually give the access of this Arduino ID in our in your port. Okay. So if I uh, go and to my PC, just go on to this PC and go to the properties. Okay. So after going this properties and let's say device manager. So in this device manager, uh, you can see here a port. When I connect my port on my Arduino ID, so I remove my mouse and connect my Arduino okay so you can see here uh, a port port here okay this on the port you can see a com and LPT okay just click on here you can see Arduino you know so if you uh, install Arduino ID and don't connect your driver in your computer so you can see here unknown device so just you need to click on here after clicking this you can see here a manual and after many you need to select the driver so inside this arduino folder you can see here a driver okay so just you need to select this driver folder and click enter so it will actually uh, install the driver in your uh, in your system of the arduino you know then you can easily upload the code in your arduino id okay so now uh, we are going to use the led uh, sequential control using this arduino you know so let's see how can we do the simulation or you can say not a simulation uh, just we are going to connect all the things and see how can we do that so after doing that we are uh, again come on our computer screen and do the code in our Arduino ID and after doing that we are going to upload the code uh, in our Arduino Uno circuit then we see the result how it actually look I think you see it in your in my demo video okay the component you are going to use that okay so this is the wire and this is the breadboard and this are some LED and this is our Arduino you know okay so you're going to use that and this is the power supply cable so uh, in Arduino you, know, you can see here a digital port so it's up to 0 to 13 and also a ground pin here and this is the analog pin okay so we are going to use that okay so first what I need to do uh, we need to connect our LED so this is the LED so you can see here uh, this is the positive port and this is the negative port so we are going to connect this so if I uh, take uh, one LED so I take this one 
So this is the uh, long path. Okay, you can see a long path. Okay, so this is the positive path and this is the negative path. So we are going to connect this negative path into our ground. You can see uh, this ground, and on this positive path, we are going to connect our Arduino uh, port. Okay. So this is the uh, negative uh, positive path. So this is the positive path. So in this positive path, we are going to connect our uh, Arduino. So let's connect it here. So this one and this one. Connect all the LED in serially. Okay. And this one also this one. And let's go and. Okay, let's connect it on here and also this one on this line and on this one and finally this one okay positive and the port okay so our LED is right now connected okay you can see here connected so now we need to uh, put here a ground port in our Arduino. So in our Arduino, uh, you know, uh, there are various types of Arduino in market like Arduino Mega, Arduino Uno and Arduino Nano. So I am going to use Arduino Uno. So let's choose one. Okay. So you can see here this is the ground port. Okay, ground port here. Okay. So I am going to uh, connect it and this ground port. And going to connect all the LED with the positive port. You can see a positive port, or you can connect it from like away from here, and also this serial port. Uh, respectively, you have to connect all the things. Okay, this one also, and also this one. And also this one so now we need to connect this uh, all the wire uh, respectively in our Arduino port so I am just choosing six seven eight nine and ten port so I am going to connect all the port here okay so if the past four okay I'm going to connect this on six number and this is the second port or I, I can connect this on the seven so this one is the seven and this one is the 8 port, 8 number 8, so this one 8 and this one our 9 and this one our 10 ok so our circuit is ready right now and now we need to uh, put here our power supply so I am going to use my laptop camera or uh, sorry, sorry not a laptop camera I am going to use my laptop power cable so this is power cable you can see here a uh, USB okay so you can also use 5 volt battery uh, in your Arduino so you can see here is the power supply cable you can also use the adapter okay and also you can uh, uh, um, add the power supply using this you can see here 5 volt okay 5 volt here okay and the ground you can also give it here so now it's time to upload our code so now so let's jump on our code in our computer skin and we after doing that we are going to run our uh, program okay so we are connecting our LED and the uh, Arduino and I'll connect our ground and using breadboard so now we need to uh, upload the code in our Arduino Uno so you can see here uh, in my connecting I connect all the port uh, 6 to 10 6 7 8 9 10 so now we need to initialize all the port in our program okay so this is the program you need to do that so you can say buyer setup so we need to set up all the code of the pin mode and for looping we are using the <coughs> digital write method to doing that up and down so now we need to initialize the port of the pin number so int LED 
so first LED we are going we connect uh, in number six and to the second one uh, we put here seven and in LED three equal we give it on number eight and in LED four we give it on nine and the in LED five we give here on the ten okay so now we need to initially solve the port error void setup function. Okay, you can see I put your setup code here to run once. So our pin mode, so our pin mode is the output mode uh, because we don't put here any input like PR motion detector sensor is the input one. So we are just going to show the output. So we need to initialize the first in parameter. First one is the number of pin. So our number of pin first one is the six and the condition is the output okay so i am going to copy it here and do it as well as same in all the things okay so this one is the two and this one is the three and this one is the four and this one is the five okay so now we are going to uh, do the <coughs> Loping function actually loping is same like as the C programming language or you can use Python programming language It's also the same so you can see in my demo video. Okay, this light is up and down So if the light is up or you can say uh, <coughs> Bright So this one is the high voltage and if the light is uh, not high or you can say It is a low voltage. Okay Up and down. Okay, or you can say close the light uh, light is closed so it is the low it is the light is open so it is the high okay so we're going to put here digital digital right so inside this parameter you have to put here the LED one and the high so high mean uh, it will actually give me a high uh, value that's when LED is open and after that uh, we are uh, using a delay function uh, to make if uh, <coughs> what do you call some delay in this <coughs> thing so delay we have put here two uh, or let's say 100 it's the millisecond that's you know you are, you are using delay at one second or you can use uh, some 500 so this is the half second and we are also using these uh, in all the IT respectively okay I'm going to copy this one Control C and doing as well as same in the all five okay so this one is the two and for three and uh, this one is the four and this one is the five okay and uh, now what you need to do uh, our LED is right now on so first time it will on in the delay second of one, one second or you can say 100 1000 millisecond or you can say one second after high we are going to low our LED that's been our LED is off so we're going to copy all the line just we need to replace high to low okay so it is about the low so low uh, copy it here actually I'm lapping to copy control V Control V and the Control B. So our code is ready right now. Okay. Our okay. So now I am going to upload our code. Okay. So let's upload our code. Yeah. So let's click on here to upload the code. Upload. So it will uploading. So I'm not going to save it right now. So it will upload it. Take some time to compiling this. You can see a compiling stage. So after compiling, uh, it will upload the code in my Arduino you know. So after uploading that, uh, we can see here some lighting effect in our LED. Okay, some compiling. You have compiling is right now completed so yep right now uploading yep uploading is completed arduino uh, done thank you so now uh, let's have a look on my uh, connection see uh, it is a light 
uh, up or on uh, or you can say um, sequential way okay so let's see so now i am connecting my power supply cable so i am going to use my laptop okay uh, you can also use your battery so it should be 5 volt or you can also use your adapter so using this okay you can also uh, do power supply but i'm going to use this one so just uh, put it on here this is a bubble power cable so you can see here this led is a light right now okay so after one second uh, it will be high and it also will low so high 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 and high okay i do it in our arduino id code so low 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 and low okay high 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 and after low you can also decrease the lower uh, delay time uh, i put here 1000 milliseconds that means one second you can also put here 0 0.5 second that's mean 5000 millisecond or you can also put here uh 2200 okay or 200 millisecond so that means 0.2 second so this is the video hope you will enjoy this video and make sure to subscribe my channel and don't forget to hit the bell icon and so please support me okay so i also make some videos regarding machine learning data science and some artificial intelligence and some uh, python programming series so now i am uh, doing some project using arduino you know okay so hope you will support me okay thank you